All right, folks, it's time once again to check out what's clicking in Cleveland. For that, we go to our digital anchor, Stephanie Haney. Stephanie, happy Friday. How are you? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking, Mike. And so are all of our high school football fans because everyone's clicking on that today. And it's the return of our WKYC game of the week. Tonight, it's the Brexville Broadview Heights Bees versus the Aurora Greenmen. Dave Dino Di Natale will be calling the game live from the stadium. I know we'll be hearing from him later in the show. And 3 News Tyler Carey will join Dino for post-game coverage. That kicks off at 6.50 tonight on WKYC.com, the WKYC app, Facebook Live, and YouTube. Now, switching to the world of sports, our Dave Chadowski talked with Cleveland pitcher Tristan McKenzie about his secret talent, solving the Rubik's Cube. Listen to this. How quickly can you do it? Uh, under two minutes, maybe a minute and a half. When's the first time you did that? Spring training of 2018. <laughs> when I, that's, when I, that's when I learned, but I always keep her close to me. I always write her initials. That is pretty fast. They also talked about tough things McKenzie has been through. If you look really close, you can see initials on his hat. Those are the initials of his baby cousin who his family lost during McKenzie's senior year of high school. And that's how he keeps her close to his heart. And they talked about texting. McKenzie's favorite emoji is the laughing emoji, but he also really likes the drunk emoji. He says it doesn't have anything to do with alcohol though, and if you get a text from him with the drunk emoji, it's probably because he's confused about whatever it is you're saying. Now, I am late to the party on this drunk emoji. Maybe I'll be getting that into the mix. My favorite is personally the smirk emoji with a little kind of like side smile. Mm. Mike, do you have a favorite emoji? I'm a real big fan of that one that just kind of looks disappointed in you. I don't know how to do it, but it's just like judging you. I like that real judgy emoji, uh, personally. That sounds very effective and also like it would be terrible <laughs> to receive. Yeah, that delay made it even better. I appreciate it. Thank you, Stephanie.